Isn't that the cop who caught the guy that was pretending to be dead? That's that cop. Seems like a decent guy. He's only a writer. He can't really help him. Well-known radio singers and orchestras are heard here on KTI. We're going to catch hell for this, banging up innocent men. The newspapers will crucify the guy. They won't have time to wonder about our mistakes. We'll be okay, Rusty, as long as we catch the guy. I hope you're right, Cole. We'll be famous if we make this case.
Keys, the cop who arrested that movie producer. It's about time some of those movie people went to jail. They think they're untouchable. What are we waiting for? These are my best shoes, Phelps. I'll leave you to it. Very funny. Whoa! Get a move on, Cole. Those boards are sinking. You want to end up like the other fossils? Gangway snakes around, Phelps. So. Can you see it through the car? Whoa! How you doing out there? I'd be doing better if you were the one trying to get across this thing. Easy. Steady. You don't want to fall in now, Phelps. That's at the forefront of my thinking. Move on, Cole. Those boards are sinking. You want to end up like the other fossils? The gangway snakes around, Phelps. So. Can you see it through the car? Steady. How you doing out there? I'd be doing better if you were the one trying to get across this thing. That's at the forefront of my thinking. One of Teresa Terrelson's shoes.
A sphere which is as many thousand spheres. Okay, where to now? What is it? An open-toed white shoe, and another stanza from the poem. Oh, I really thought that hobo bum did the Terrelson bra. Confessions from the insane aren't the most credible evidence, Rusty. Is this thing over? It's all part of his power over us, making us run round all over the city for the crumbs he's leaving us. So if we keep this up, we can find the guy? You drive. I need to go over the case notes. 
So this guy looks out for women in bars who've had too much to drink. Who are emotionally disturbed. Need a shoulder to cry on, he plies them with booze. Probably offers them a lift home. Then beats their brains out and strangles them. Could be any schmo hanging out in the bar. No, not anyone. He displays the bodies, leaves us messages. For all the violence, it's very controlled behavior. On it goes. When do you think we'll reach the end of this thing? The center of the proverbial labyrinth? How long is a piece of string? How many unsolved murders have we got in this city? How many solved ones? I survived the war for this. Ah. That's the guy from the papers. Solved that big case. Wow. That sure looks like a beauty. The nice thing about egotists, they don't talk he about other people. He just refuses to accompany me to church. He'll never find out. I'm not as dumb as you look. I think his name is Phelps. He brought in that case for that poor lady killed near City Hall. Whoa! Easy! You gotta be kidding. I could save all year and never afford that. Well, you don't see that every day. My acting coach says I have real talent. Only movie stars have things like that. Wow, that sure looks like a beauty. I survived the war for this? Ah. Hey, there's such a thing as soap, you know. Are you drunk, mister, or are you just cracked? Tell a man that there are 400 billion stars and he'll believe you. Tell him a bench has wet paint on it and he has to touch uh, it. You got a problem, pal? He's good looking for a policeman. <laughs> Am I missing something here? It's quite hard to concentrate when you're standing there staring at me. See him? Saw his picture in the paper. Worked that case with the lady cut up like the Dahlia. Do you think my husband will buy me that? Wow, that sure looks like a beauty. The nice thing about egotists, they don't talk about other people.
I recognize that guy from the papers. He's a cop. And on it goes. What do you think will reach the end of this thing? The center of the proverbial labyrinth? How long is a piece of string? How many unsolved murders have we got in this city? How many solved ones? I think his name is Phelps. I read about him in the newspaper. I think his name is Phelps. He brought in that case with that poor lady killed near City Hall. Are you drunk, mister, or are you just cracked? intention of going in. I heard that thing's tricky. I'm on the way here and have a quiet smoke. Think about hidden meetings. belonging to Celine Axford Henry. altars, judgment seats, and prisons. No, it couldn't be.
See? That was easy. I found Celine Henry's ring. How far does this thing go? How did we not catch this nut job? That's the cop from the newspaper. Don't need this. I survived the war for this. Ah. That's the one. About a week ago, this guy murdered his wife and dumped her. But that's the cop who put him away. Let me guess. Hiding from the wife? Can you drive to this one? He's leaving us this trail of evidence. Why? Vanity. He wants to see if there's anyone out there smart enough to catch him. He leaves this evidence, but every location is a trap. He's testing us, physically and mentally, to see whether we are worthy of him. The Titan guy, who had the stouts with God. Very good. You thinking about reading some Shelley? All that egghead stuff? Uh, I'm sticking to the funny papers in the form now to sleep better. There's a the throne up there. Now it's just a matter of getting to it. Now look what you did. Hang on, Cole. I'll get you off of there. You gotta make it to the next platform. Get that thing as close as you can, then jump.
typewriter ring. Evelyn Summers. Place he calls home. End of the line. No, 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 no. Come on. Ah, no. I thought the whole thing was going to come crashing down on him. I thought so, too. He murdered Evelyn Summers, Rusty. The last trophy was her ring. Did you find another piece of the poem? Yes. The last piece. You sure, Cole? Let's find out. This whole thing is religious. Man against God. This isn't about church, is it? I might see this as a cry for help. For God's sake, Phelps. You're not trying to justify this. Hear me out, Rusty. This guy has been successfully slaughtering women in this town for half a year, maybe longer. He researches who he kills, and then plants evidence so that we always have someone to go after. If he hadn't sent the letters and the poem, he could have gone on forever. We would have been none the wiser. We would have four executed men on our conscience and have been happy about it. Why else is he doing this? You're the new face of the department, Phelps. The modern cop who tries to understand why the perp does what he does. Me? I just drop the hammer down on the low lives. Crunch a roach under your heel, you don't worry about what it's feeling, you just grind it into the pavement. Reminds me of my days as an altar boy. There's a light coming from the house. Nothing hasty, gentlemen. Keep your hands where I can see them, or I'll be forced to redecorate the stucco with your entrails. We're from the LAPD, sir. I'm going to tell you only once to lower your weapon. The LAPD, you say? Is it really possible you could have found me after all this time? How interesting. Put down the gun, shitbird. Last warning. 
This boorish ignoramus could never have found me. It was you, wasn't it? Do you remember me, detective? The temp bartender. Yes, you found me. You know what I'm capable of, and yet you walk in here like lambs dressed for the slaughter. We'll see about that. Where did he go? Down the tunnel? We can't let the son of a bitch get away. The house, Rusty. There must be another entrance into the house. LAPD, give yourself up. If we can bring him in alive, there's enough physical evidence for an airtight case. You heard him, Cole. He's fucking nuts. What are the chances of hauling him out of here alive? Medical experience, maybe? At least some working knowledge of biology. He's cruel and he's methodical. I hate to think what he's done with this thing. You realize this must have been the place, Rusty. It's the basis for all his riddles. Prometheus defied the cruel gods. This guy thinks he's doing the same thing. Defying gods can be hazardous to your health. We're going down there. I'll go. Call for backup and keep an eye out above ground and see where this thing comes out. Don't let me down, Rusty. You're an interesting man, detective. Why the police force? You're obviously over. Shit. It really hurts.
Do I get a sense you're looking for personal redemption? Do you think we have something in common? Reinforcements are on the way. Cease and desist. Acquainted with slaughter? Does it attract you? Have you felt the power? Understood the power? Are you comfortable out of the light, officer? Are you comfortable? Surrender now, or I will use deadly force. This thing has come to an end. You know that. You're exactly what I expected. We were looking for a low achiever. Reinforcements are on the way. Cease and desist. I will use deadly force. Where's the press, Cap? I think Phelps and I should get a medal for this. This has got to be the case of the year, right? The case of the century, when you think about it. Are you finished? Yes, Skipper. Good. Because there won't be any press briefings or commendations. What are you talking about? We got the werewolf, the guy who killed the Dahlia, killed all the other broads. You got no one. Mason was a ghost. Can you at least tell us why, Captain? Mason is the half-brother of one of the most highly elected officials in this country. How high? Beyond the moon for mere mortals like us, Rusty. There'll be no more mention of him. The city owes you both, but there'll be no mileage in ever bringing this up again. What's going to happen to the suspects in the cases, Captain? I won't be a part of that. A bit of missing evidence at the grand jury. A procedural error here, a mistake there. They'll all be quietly let go. The DA knows how we'll have to play it. So that's it? I'm afraid it is. And I have some news for you, Phelps. No more rooting around in the entrails of cadavers and corpses for you. The head of vice has asked the chief for you. I'm reluctant to see you go to the glory boys of advice, but my hands are tied. Go home to that lovely wife of yours and celebrate your promotion.
leave out, kid. You'll go purple. I'm scared, Sarge. Everybody's scared, kid. Anyone who says he isn't is a damn liar. How many times have you been in combat, Sarge? I was with Raider Battalion on Peleliu my first time. Was it bad? It's always bad. Will this be bad? As bad as it gets, kid. But you stick by the Marine next to you, and he will stick by you. So some of the guys, they aren't very friendly, Sarge. They've lost a lot of their friends in the last couple of days, kid. They think if they don't get to know you, that they won't have to grieve for you if you get killed. They're wrong. It doesn't work that way. Don't worry. No Marine in this company will let you down. <laughs>